everyone, today I'm going to be doing a really easy style that I learned a few months ago and I really like it, especially when my hair is dirty and if I slip on it wet and there's no fixing it. So I'm going to go ahead and get started and all I'm going to do is take a little triangle section here in the front of my hair, mostly my bangs because my bangs are pretty short. And I am also going to throw in a little back combing in mine just because I have a cowlick in the front of my hair that likes to split. So this kind of helps it just a little bit stay together. And I'm going to spray the front. You do not have to do this. That is just something I have to do to keep it from separating. And then grab a clear elastic just tie that off and then you can kind of pull it together and then pull it apart to where you want it to sit or how big you want it all right so once you have that section I'm gonna go ahead and pull up another section back to where my eyebrows end and then just go all the way back with that and if you need to smooth it out or it can be as messy as you would like it and then get another clear elastic and then tie this off and then you're gonna hold your ponytail so you can kind of see where you've tied it hold that ponytail and then you can kind of pull and bubble up that first little hump and then I'm gonna go through here and kind of pull this part a little as well so it's not flat to my head. And I'm just doing it very easy because I have those layers. Now something I am gonna do, which if you have longer hair and you don't have um, short bangs like mine, you wouldn't have to do this, but I'm going to bobby pin up my bangs because I don't want them kind of I like to have it a little more bubble than the front so I'm just gonna take a little bobby pin and pin it so that it doesn't get all flat on me so that kind of just helped add a little bit more and I'm going to cross it underneath on the other side so it kind of it in place. All right. So, and then you can just again bubble as much as you want on that ponytail that you did. Now I'm gonna go ahead and spray mine so that it doesn't pull out anymore. All right. So then I'm gonna take another section right right here by my ear and. Just depending how many bubbles you want, you can take more or less sections. So I'm gonna take another here and then tie this off with an elastic. Like that. And then I'm gonna go ahead and tighten it a little bit to my head so that I can pull it better apart. And this part, I like not as loose as here, just cause I don't want it to be falling down as much. And then again, you'll hold that ponytail and then just pull that bubble. You can make it as bubbly as you would like. And then you can kinda, when we're done, we'll fine tune a little bit more. And you can pull pieces around your face. It's however you like to wear it. So, so far that's what we have going on. And then I'm going to take probably, let's see, because my hair's shorter. This will probably be my last section. I'll go ahead and pull that up. And if you have longer hair, you can either leave it in a ponytail. I probably won't leave mine in a ponytail because it's so short. But I'm going to tie it off with an elastic, a clear elastic again. 
And I'm going to kind of put mine in just a little messy bun. Just to help add with the bubble. And then I'm going to hold that and pull this bubble out. And you can make it as messy as you would like. Or as clean. So, and then I'm just going to pull apart my messy bun. Alright. And then you can kind of go in and fine tune. And so now I'm just kind of fine tuning, pulling it apart. Use my handheld mirror because I can't see my head. So I kind of like it a little messier like it is right now. So there you go. That is the bubble braid. And I hope you like this video. And that is it guys. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and stay tuned for more videos. See you later.